Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix uh, Euro Truck Simulator 2 crashing. So first of all, uh, if you haven't tried that already, just try to restart your PC. If you have already tried that, then you want to go ahead on Steam, find the game, right click on it, go to properties, installed files, and then verify integrity of game files. You want to go ahead and do that and see if the problem was fixed. This will basically fix any corrupted files or missing files. And now, if that didn't fix the problem, you want to try to delete all mods from your mod folder if you are using mods. So it will be on documents, Euro Truck Simulator 2, and here is mod folder. You want to go ahead and just um, remove the mods from here, add them, for example, to your desktop or whatever, and try to play the game and see if the problem was fixed or not. Sometimes it works. Now, what you can also try to do is go on Steam, right click on Euro Truck Simulator, go to Properties, then click on Betas, and on Beta Participation, you can go ahead and choose a older version of Euro Truck Simulator and play it. You can also go ahead and try to play Euro Truck Simulator um, in safe mode right there and see if the problem was fixed or not. Now, another thing to try is open up the folder where your game is so for me it would be here on I'm, I'm just gonna browse it now once you are here you want to find the game crash file if you cannot uh, find this file like i do then everything is fine and you don't need to delete it now another thing you want to check while you are here go to bin and then win uh, x64 and here is your truck to exe file you want to go ahead and open it uh, with properties and here uh, on target uh, you may see something written so you want to go ahead and delete it sometimes there's like our device gl you want to go ahead and delete anything here if you uh, have ever changed it now while you're here you want to go ahead and try to uh, go to properties and compatibility and run this program as administrator disable full screen optimizations and even run this program in compatibility mode for windows 8 just try all of these three separately and if that didn't fix the problem just uncheck them and uh, leave it like so now, uh, most common uh, problem is with the drivers of your PC. So you want to just go ahead and update your drivers completely. Go to your, for example, if you're using NVIDIA, then go to NVIDIA app and update your drivers. Or, or you can go ahead to the website and just download the newest, latest drivers from the website. The same for AMD Radeon and so on and so forth. So after you've done that, you also want to check for updates on your Windows operating system. So for for example, I am up to date. Now, another thing you want to try is to disable or sync. So you want to open up your documents uh, folder, your truck simulator, and then you will find config CFG. You want to go ahead and open it, of course, with a notepad. Now, once you have opened it, you want to go ahead, click edit, then find and just write down uh, color feedback and here it is now you want to go ahead and change the color feedback from one right there to zero and after that you want to save and close and save your file now if that didn't work you also want to open up on search cmd command prompt run it as administrator click yes and right there you want to just run sfc a space forward slash and scan now and it will basically find any files which uh, may need to be fixed now another thing to try out is go to settings then you want to go to system storage and on temporarily files you want to delete all temporarily files if you don't want to delete your downloads then just leave it like so but basically you want to select all of those and remove the files. And now if nothing actually worked, I would just suggest you to uninstall the game and reinstall it again. And yeah, if this video was helpful, guys, make sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.